In today's short video, I want to show you how your line of sight creates strain in your neck, especially in the context of bad posture, and what we can do about it. Welcome, I'm Olivier Girard, ergonomist, posture therapist, author of the Posture Manual, and creator of three online posture programs. Let's start with some very typical examples of daily life situations. Look what happens when you lean on your forearms like we all do. Your line of sight goes down, but your screen is in front of you, so you go here, you mess up your neck. Other situation, now I lean backwards. My line of sight is here upwards, but that's not where my screen is, so again, I mess up my neck. In the first example, I was messing up the upper cervical spine, in the second example, I'm messing up the lower cervical spine. Let's see what happens when we stand now. Look, I'm a tall guy or I'm a bit depressed. Here goes my line of sight. But, I mean, apart from short people like me, that's not where the rest of the world is. Hence, you go there, you mess up your neck again. Now, let's say that you have weight forward due to a belly, yeah? Whether you're pregnant, whether you're overweight, doesn't matter. When your weight is forward more, you will tend to stand like this, yeah? And as a result, your line of sight goes here, but again, that's not where your life is, so you go there. Now, let's say that I want to look at something under my, my desk or clean up the mess. I'm facing the desk and I'm here, but I don't see anything, so I go there. Whereas if I would be here, my neck would be rotated, but that would be much less strenuous on the neck. Final example, I have a young boy. I take him by the hand and I walk forward. Again, I messed up my neck. You're smart, I don't need to say more. You see, every example that I've showed you is a double kill on your neck. Why? Because your general posture will shift your head forward most of the time, which is source number one of neck strain. And then it will impact your line of sight and you'll correct, which is mistake number two. So what does this mean in terms of treatment? It means that if we want to save your neck, we have two things to do. Number one, we have to work on your general posture, which is the reason why I have developed the online posture programs. And number two, we need to accept that the line of sight is not uh, horizontal. You see, when I stand properly, which is that, my line of sight is slightly downwards. Why is it slightly below horizontal? Well, for a simple reason. When we were all living in Africa, basically what helped us survive is our ability to detect a predator at a safety distance, you know, so that we could react. So typically, we're looking at 30, 40 meters downwards in direction of the ground. We are not looking horizontally forward as society made us believe in the latest times. So to cut a long story short, if you have neck pain, do not be satisfied with people who are going to manipulate your neck. Your neck is just the surface of the problem. Your general posture and your line of sight are the two big issues that result in your neck pain.